Hello guys and welcome to the next episode of Cities Skylines with me Pippa. Thank you very much for joining me. So we're starting today a brand new scenario. Uh, we've already played through for the new Mass Transit DLC. We played Fix the Traffic. We played Ferry Empire. Those two worked out very well. Really enjoyed those. Go and check those out if you haven't seen them. The last one that was added with this DLC is called Trains. And as you can see... This is a totally blank map. Now, there's some interesting win and lose conditions here, and there's some nice information that's given about this scenario as well. So let's have a quickly look, uh, quickly look at this. The win conditions construct 210 instances of train tracks, and then transport 200,000 people using trains. So the description here says, a vast plane yearning for a city brimming with trains now there's some interesting stuff here this scenario is all about building train routes and transporting citizens with trains an extra reward is offered for building industrial areas i'm still getting over this cold my voice is a bit croaky <clears throat> let's say that again industrial areas of all specialization so farming forest ore and oil and connecting them to the rail network with cargo train stations. Starts with an empty map, medium difficulty. The losing conditions are interesting. So there's a couple of tiers that have been put in here. Different levels, I mean by tiers. So you lose if you play 20 game weeks with population under 1,000. So within 20 weeks, we need to go over 1,000 population. Then you have 150 weeks to get above 12,000. Um, otherwise you lose and also you lose if you run out of money so that's the idea you don't want to spend all your money and it's given you a couple of targets to aim for and some extra stuff here that will give us some extra rewards so i'm looking forward to doing that i just wanted to show you i am using some mods at the moment i wish there was a way to easily sort here which ones it says sort by name but they're sorted via randomly stuff anyway uh, to sort which ones i just had rather than showing all of them so i'm using the tree brush mod i'm using automatic bulldoze you've seen that one before find it just so you can easily find any mods and assets that you've got because i've got a huge list of those i've got network extensions too again because that's now been updated to work with the mass transit dlc so we're going to dive in with that one um, I've also got Daylight Classic. So this changes the way the game looks. Doesn't affect anything else. Uh, Cloud and Fog Toggler. That's pretty obvious. Um, and I think there's one more. Transport Lines Manager Reborn. So we'll have a look at that when we get into the game. Um, I've also got a couple of uh, colour corrections. We're going to be using one of these. I think we're going to use the AD Cooler colour correction. Just makes the game look a bit nicer. Photo Reel is fantastic drops your fps quite a lot but we're going to be giving this one a go so there we go i'm going to start a brand new game with that scenario and i'll be back with you once it's loaded up okay well let's take a look at the map that we have this is our starting area let's just do that so we can see what we've got we've got this square here uh, we've got our entrance from the highway i'm just looking around for train tracks there's one down there in the corner there's one up there and I think there's one over this side. Yeah, so we've got to expand out. So let's have a look. Even with another square, we're not going to hit that one. Or that one, I don't think. So that's interesting. So they're making us keep all of our train line stuff internal, right? I mean, it's going to be a while before we get big enough to get trains and stuff. We've got to get 2,800 population before we get to that. But yeah, we've got everything here that we need to get started. So let's spend a little bit of money um we have to put down a tiny road don't we to unlock some other roads so let's do that we don't want to go below zero and we have if i remember 20 weeks to get to 1000 population so how are we going to do this i want some six lane one-way roads i like to put like a little roundabout in here if we can so let's have that uh, will you please get to... Why won't it snap to that line there? Oh, there we go. <laughs> that was a bit weird. Um, let's just make this a small one. We don't need to make this particularly big. Go on, you can do it. Snap to where I want you to snap. Thank you very much. And is that gone correctly? Yeah, that's fine. So like a, a smallish roundabout. Just so people can get in and out. There we go. Um, let's turn that one back on again. Good. And then we can start expanding. So, 
that's quite a big road. Let's go with... What have we got? Four lane, just something a little bit cheaper. Four lane road with median. Mm, I just don't want to spend too much money. Basic road with turning lane, two lane roads. I mean, I would go with these large... Let's go with one of these, just because it isn't going to cost us as... Oh, how much do these cost? 67 a cell. Yeah, that's cheaper. I think the six lane are like 80 a cell. So, we are going to have... There we go. It's weird that it's doing that. We're going to have our residential this side, our industry sort of along this way over here. Although, to start off with, it's going to be... Let's go to there and go to there. It's going to be in this little area here. We're not going to spend too much too much money, hopefully. We're going to need water as well. Um, how are we going to do this? Let's see if we put a pipe down the middle there. This water is going to go in the middle. Let's put it to one side in case we need more than one. Let's put it over there. And hopefully that will be far enough away from our industry stuff. And it won't cause a problem. Um, we need coal. We need a power. I mean, we don't have to go for a coal power plant. But I'm thinking to start off with, let's get as much power as we can. Uh, let's get that into there. As usual, these power lines will probably disappear when we don't need them. Right. And then for our houses, let's just get some of these going. We want to start them back from the junction. And not get them too close to the motorway. Oh, we're also going to need... Man, we're spending money like nobody's business. Uh, a water drainage pipe. Yeah, let's... I don't want to fill up all of this water. I don't want to put that drainage pipe too far away. It's going to take us a lot of pipe to get down to here. And it's going to need some electricity. How much does that cost? 6,000. How much to run these along here? 3,360, 4,000, we could do that, that would actually be cheaper. Okay, well, let's put these along here. And then we're going to run that down to here. And hopefully that was cheaper, yeah, definitely. There we go, that's good. And then we'll connect that up to here somewhere. Okay, that's all the power and everything set up. That's all the basics, <laughs> hopefully. Uh, let's do these. I want these set away from the road. I'm going to delete that. Can I have that filled in? Thank you very much. And those two. What is there? Why won't that fill in? There's nothing there. Hmm, interesting. Let's delete that. That's weird that they won't fill those ones in. Oh, well, anyway, we'll let that grow. Uh, let's unpause. So we've got... Um, for, let's see. Yeah, power's coming in. We've got water. We've got electricity. Oh, let's have a quick look at our budget. All of this can go down low. Trying to save as much money as possible to start off with. Because we are going to be losing money. Yes. And also, let's have a look. Um, yeah. We've put down a lot of roads. So we're obviously paying 60... Just the budget, how many vehicles? Yeah, we are paying a lot. I think we're okay for electricity and water. Yeah, we've got plenty of that. Okay, let's see. Oh, people are moving in. Nice. Um, shall I just expand this way as well? I think that's probably a good idea. Let's keep it all compact, close to each other. What did that cost? 800. Let's do the same over here. I'm really hoping we can, we can hit the targets we want to hit. Without running out of money. Oh, darn it. That was the wrong stuff. Let's do that. There we go. Let's go up to there. I'm keeping everything by the main road free. I think this is probably going to need water. It is. Let's see. If we go across there. Try and get that lined up perfectly. Let's overlap it a tiny bit. There we go. Excellent. Get some more people moving in. What are we at? Zero population, even though we do have some houses. And we're losing money. Well, it was bound to happen, wasn't it? <laughs> so this is Lee Boulevard through here. What have we got? Beach Street. 
It's funny how there's no cars coming in, but there's houses popping up. All oh, these got no water this side. Well, we need to fix that as well then. Let's run that pipe down there. Yeah, that's overlapping ever so slightly. Just want to make sure we're definitely covered and we have no problems. There we go. Hopefully. Yeah, we've got sewage. Water tank usage. Good, good, good. Oh, let's unpause. That will help, won't it? Uh, we don't have any need for industry and stuff yet, but we've got space for that when we need it, just to get a little bit. And our shops, we might just have a little section. Maybe here for shops. Off the main roads, perhaps. I really want to keep this free and keep it moving, so we might not do that. Let's see how it goes. I'm just worried about my figure here. Oh, we've got one person in. Excellent. We could speed things up a bit and see how it goes, can't we? Let's have a look. I have to say, this colour change mod thing here. Oh, look at that house. That is looking nice. This is looking really good. I'm liking the way this looks. Really adds to that realism, doesn't it? Can people get into the city okay? I've, I've not done anything wrong here, have I? They can come in, they can go round, they can go off. Yes, it's fine. It just seems weird that we've got people moving in, but no cars coming in. Not one car has driven into our city. Where we're up. Hey, what have we got here? Is that an ore truck? Where are you taking stuff to? The coal power plant. Fantastic. There we go. Do you know what we might just do here? Is have a look at... Have a look at these. And t turn off traffic lights there and there and here just so people can move in and around and also let's just have another quick look at that this one here we want those to stop and those to stop so the roundabout has priority um if that's coming in do i want those to stop as well so people leaving yeah, let's leave it like that. We'll see how it goes. I mean, it's not like we're overwhelmed with traffic at the moment, is it? There we go. Oh, we have some other needs. Okay, hadn't spotted that. Let's get some industry going in here. So, how are we going to do this? Let's extend... What was this? Four-lane road with turning lanes. Okay, let's grab one of those again. That's this one. Let's go... Up to the end there. Let's add some of these in. Um, if I go alongside that one. Yep, that's fine. Excellent. That's what I want to do. They probably need water. There we go. Excellent. We may as well run that. Ooh, that's going to slightly... Let's undo that. I want to just overlap that a tiny bit so they're not worrying about water. And let's get some of our industry... In there, but not there. Yep, and we need some commercial. So where should we put that? Um, I didn't really want it right by the high streets. There, I want to keep that as free as possible. The same as on that side. So what we might do... Is if we extend this a little bit. Let's put all these back on again. Bong, 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 bong. We extend that out to there. How's the money? 9,000. Oh, my goodness. Got to start making money. And we'll have this as... Do you know what I was just thinking here we could do? Hmm. No, let's keep it simple. Let's keep it simple. We can, we can change things later if we need to. But at the moment, let's just keep it simple. And we'll have as commercial... In this section here as well. There we go. That one seems like it's a little bit too close. Because I wanted to keep that. Uh, we'll keep it 3 by 2 That'll be fine. If we go up to there. That'll be okay. And we'll do the same here. That gives us a little bit more room. There we go. We'll keep that separate. Just so they're not worried about noise. And all that sort of stuff. Electricity should reach. How are we doing? Electricity's fine. Water's fine. We're up to 186. What do we need to get? A thousand. So we're going to have to grow this quite a bit, aren't we? To get a thousand people in here. Industry still got plenty of space. I might do this as a double commercial section. You'll see what I mean. 
Let's go back into here again. We'll get another one there, another one there. Oh, my water. Let's, yeah, let's not mess that up. Oh, perfect. That even helped me line it up there. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Yeah, lots of commercial needs. Let's fill that in then. Up to there. And up to there. Yeah, that's good. We'll keep that bit free. How's our industry going? We still have some space for some more industry if you need to. We're down to 1,000 and we're losing minus 656. Oh my goodness. Wow. And there's nothing else we can change on the budget. I think maybe we just need to let this go. We've got space for things to grow. We have a tiny industry need, but we're okay at the moment. I might just add a little bit more in there. Yep, they can grow there. Water's fine. Not quite. Let's get that pipe. Oh, it's not going to let me go down there, is it? Let's go this way then. We'll have that one there. Uh, that's annoying, isn't it? It's not going to let me snap at that angle. Okay, fine. Let's go that way. And we're out of money. Oh, well, there we go. Oh, my goodness me. Are we going to manage to... Are we going to fail this before we've even started? We're growing. We've got space for growing. Things are looking good. I'm quite liking this, this start. I'm liking the way it's looking. <gasps> But what's going to happen? I don't know. Um, let's watch this unfold. We're losing... Okay, the loss we're getting is getting smaller. We only have 237 left. It may be that I've spent too much money on roads that are now costing us money. They're costing us 256 a week. Perhaps I should have gone with smaller roads. Okay, let's, let's speed this up and see what happens. Are we going to get to zero before we run out of money? Oh, look, we are. We're going to suddenly start making money. Yeah, we're making money. Oh, phew. <laughs> I didn't want to start that all again. Thank goodness for that. Thank goodness for that. Okay, that's good. So do we have space for more people? That's what they want. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're not going to get too fussy here. Let's, let's get these ones going. And then this is going to start again. This is going to be people again over here. There we go. Good. Wow. Phew. Okay, so everything's working. Yep. Everything's working. So we just got to concentrate on getting enough people in so we've got enough money. Uh, seriously, not enough money to build that. 612. Let's speed, speed it up a bit more. So what do I need to get that? 800 to put in another road. Go on, you can do it, game. We're making... Yeah, there we go. Excellent. And then, of course, every time we do that, whoops, we've got to remember water pipes and stuff because, yeah, these guys are not covered, are they? What we're going to do, we're going to change that. We're going to bring that down to there and then take this one out. 600. Oh, I've never. It's been so long since I've started a game from scratch and to have, have to worry about money this much. Okay, water availability is going to start going down. We've got to be careful. Let's keep our eye on it. How much is another one of these going to cost us? 3,500. Blimey. And electricity is going to cost us... Oh, my goodness. Well, we're gaining 1,000. So, let's, let's sort of maybe sit back and relax. Try not to worry about all the different needs that we have. <laughs> the roundabout's working good. People can walk to work if they want to. I mean, they've got paths around here. They can cross over. I'll tell you what we could do here is we could... Oh, we can't even do that, can we? 1,600 population. How are we doing over here? We're almost halfway through. And we're almost up to half the population that we need. So, that, that should go up, shouldn't it? But it's not. We've got 472. <gasps> Electricity has gone down. Oh, I tell you what, know what we're talking about. We can just put this up, can't we? There we go. Let's put our budget up. And we can put the water budget up a bit as well. I'd forgotten about that. Oh, 
Okay, that's like taking us through the roof. Are we still making money? Still just about making money. We're sort of breaking even. It's not going up or down. Yay! Little Hamlet. A population of 500. Whew. So now we can put garbage, healthcare, education in. So they are going to suddenly now definitely want all of that. We can't buy a square, can we? No, well, we don't want to do that. Uh, taxes, we can put up a tiny bit. Let's just pause a sec. Right, taxes are going to go up to 11. Because we need to make money. Uh, 11. And I don't think we can do the high density stuff yet anyway. So that's fine. Wow. Okay. Um, yeah, we're doing okay for both of those. So let's not worry too much about that. Healthcare, they're going to want that. So I'm quite happy to put that. Let's have a look. What are we putting it against here? Yeah, I want to put that maybe over here. So they can quickly get to the roundabout. In fact, we could even put it up again. Oh no, we're going to have roads coming off of here, aren't we? In fact, the roads coming off of it are probably going to end up being wider. Yeah, let's put it there. If they need to get out and get straight onto there, that's fine. That'll keep everybody happy. Can I look at my... No, I still can't check out the natural resources, which is what I wanted to do. Okay, so we have a need... Medium demand for residential. Well, we've got that. Oh, we need to put some trash stuff in. They are going to want that, aren't they? So, let's see. We don't want it anywhere near our water. But we can now extend down here. Let's do that. What's that going to cost us? Two thousand. Let's not spend too much money. Otherwise, we are going to be running out at some point. Let's get that lined up. Let's go to there. Yeah, there we go. Let's do that. What have we got? 8,000. Oh, okay. I think, we're in, I think we're in the clear with the money. We're growing okay. Let's have a look. Okay, we're halfway through. We've got over... Yep. Over halfway of the people that we need. So we really just need to make sure... There's plenty of spots for people to move into. Uh, let's get our garbage stuff down because they're going to really want to do that. Uh, will that fit into here? Yes, perfect. Look at that. There we go. Let's do that. Do they need power? No, they don't. Excellent. That's good. Uh, we might be able to just put this back up to 100% again. It doesn't cost us much more, but it keeps the roads in good condition. Yeah, let's do that. There we go. Garbage trucks are going out. Fantastic. And then hopefully that's going to encourage more people to move in. We still don't get... Oh, schools. There we go. That was the other thing. What do we need for that? 10,000. Wow. And then that will encourage more people to move in, won't it? Definitely. Um, oh, there we go. Houses are coming. Excellent, excellent, excellent. I've not done a grid-based city for a long time. We're not necessarily going to stay with the grid-based city, but I wanted to sort of see what it was going to be like. So a quick sip of tea. Having not done one before... Oh, we can get loans, can't we? It's going to cost us 400 a week. Let us get a loan. We can start getting some of this stuff down. Look at that. So we have our normal elementary school. I've got a load of assets as well. I'm, I'm, try, I'm going to try and not use stuff that's going to sort of break the game. So, as we're trying to do a scenario, if it was normal... Like that, Ramsey High School. What's that? That costs 24000 560 a week holds 2000 That costs 10000 Oh, yeah, let's go for the normal one. Um, so, anything that's going to change the way the game is played, like the high-capacity stuff, I won't use it as we're doing a scenario. So, we'll, we'll try and stick uh, to the normal stuff. I'm going to put the school here amongst the shops um let's have a look yeah just so it's sort of in the middle of where there we go everybody's happy let's have a look at the happiness yeah it's going up 43 percent how many people are going to be moving into the school 27 out of 300 let's speed things up a bit we still have a need okay yeah we can deal with that by building more roads. That's exactly what we want. Uh, let's get this one out a bit further. There we go. 
I don't know why it doesn't click to the one you want it to sometimes. It's weird. I'm not going to worry too much. There we go. What have we got? 10,000. Let's just keep some money. So, one, two, three, one, two, three. I'm going to try and sort of keep this in a pattern of sorts. So, let's do that there. Let's do that there. Make sure they've got water. Just about. Well, we're going to carry that one down and that one down. I'm hoping that that's okay. And then I want to carry on one down here as well. So, let's bring... That no, it needs to go further. Basically, I want the pipe over here somewhere. Is that going to connect? Oh, it will. Perfect. So then, if I go like that, yep, that's good. And that covers any new rows as well. Spot on. What are we up to? 753. <gasps> Six weeks left to get to a thousand. Come on, people. We can do it. Okay, is there any needs we can give them? Okay, people are still moving in. Let's check the score. 213 out of 300. We are going to need another school. And there's need for more industry. Okay, let's keep on top of this. Let's keep on top of this. Uh, I was going to try and keep industry off the main road. But for now, let's just... Let's just fill it in. Uh, is that one going to overlap enough? Yep, just enough. Uh, let's go out a little bit further there. Get that one. We might as well go all the way down because we're going to be filling this in as we go anyway. There we go. Plenty of room for more industry. Yep, to move in. How's electricity looking? Electricity's dropping a bit. Well, that's fine. We can up our budget some. There we go. Water availability. Yep, let's up our budget some. Still making money. We're up to 828. Oh man, it's going to be close. Five weeks to go. I think we're going to do it. I think we're going to be fine. So this is going to be another commercial section. So let's put that in. I don't know whether we need that much commercial. I mean, it's filling in. Maybe we don't. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's not quite filled in as much, is it? So maybe we'll go... One, two, three, four, five, six. We'll go double... We'll go double the section here instead. Double for the repeating pattern. I love patterns. It's funny, you know, whenever I do city skylines, I always do, like I've mentioned, I go for the organic look of stuff. Um, but patterns, I love patterns. I love counting patterns. I love, let's get that one there. Drawing patterns, seeing patterns in things. It's, you know, it's something I do enjoy a lot. We're going to need another school, aren't we? Yeah. Let's, they're going to cost a lot of money. We don't have the money. What are we up to? 906. How long have we got? Four weeks to go. We should be fine. We should be fine. How's the healthcare going? That's all the way down here. I'm wondering whether I, I mean, that's sort of, oh, it's got zero patients. Okay. I mean, at the minute, that's covering everything, isn't it? So... I think we're going to do it. 951. Plenty of space to expand. And I'm liking the look of this. I'm liking the look of this so far. This is looking really good. Let me know in the comments below what sort of things you'd like to see me do as well. I mean, we've got to obviously start working towards trains. That is going to take us to get to 2,800 population. I hope we're going to hit this. Come on. Four weeks to go. Yeah, we're going to hit it. And then we're going to start trying to do what we did with the ferry scenario where we were forcing people to use ferries in, in ways that you wouldn't normally do. So we were cutting things off by road, making them use ferries. We can do a similar thing with this. We can make sure uh, that people have to use trains to get around. And remember as well, we want all the different types of industry. Was, oh, we can't do districts yet, but all the different sorts. That will give us some extra rewards as well. This will probably be expanded. Way Worthy village, a population of 1,000. Fantastic. So now we can buy extra squares. We've got districts. All sorts of things kicking now. That is really good. So we've done that one. Um, population, I'm, I'm assuming that when that gets to 20, we're going to get a tick or something over here, and that's fine. I hope so. I mean, that's... Well done. The city is growing fast. Keep this up, and your trains will have plenty of passengers to carry. So our next goal 
2,800. I don't think we're quite aiming for that yet. Our next goal is 1,600. But yeah, obviously we were speaking about the different types of districts. We've got all the specializations we can do to get some extra rewards. This roundabout may grow, get a bit bigger. But yeah, I think we've done really well. What are we up to for the weeks? Let's get ourselves to 20 weeks and just make sure that we've completed this successfully. I'm pretty sure we have. Let's have a look. Yeah, people are still growing. Oh, we've got enough money now for another school. Let's check. Yeah, that's got 253. So what I'm going to do here is 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. I'm going to put another school actually just in there. In the middle of this one. Yeah, there we go. So that's evenly spread out. And I think with all the growth that we're getting as well, that's probably good. Uh, we need a bit more electricity. We're sort of getting up to the point where we're going to have to have these at 100%. Uh, yeah, water up a tiny bit. Let's get that up a tiny bit there. I've never been one for having a different amount for, for day time and night time. Any of you guys ever done that? I don't know whether that's ever needed or not. I've never really noticed it. Two weeks to go. Things are growing nicely. What have we got? Yep, we've got space down here. So now they're going to want some of these things as well. So I'm thinking police... Hmm. I wanted to put that on this side here. We're going to have to connect up our electricity again. Let's just pause a sec. Oh, electricity's connected anyway. No, nope, that's fine. And then fire department, we're going to need that too. Not enough money. What do we need for that? Uh, police, what did I just put in? Police station. Yeah, I want fire department. Oh, there we go. Thank you. 12,000. Okay, well, we're almost there. What are we up to on the week's? Nearly got the next week. And our population is not under a 1,000. We've got 1,200 and it's still growing. Let's have a look. Yeah, still space for expansion to fill all our needs. Yeah, there we go. We get the orange tick for 20 weeks and we've gone over a 1,000. Perfect. That's good. So, now it's just working our way up to trains and not losing any money. I think, I think we're going to manage to do that well in our city of sigilville guys leave a like if you're looking forward to the start of this new scenario i most definitely am hit the big b with the tea stain to subscribe and not miss out as we grow our city together and start working towards all the trains looking forward to that and i will see you guys tomorrow for the next one thanks for watching take care Bye bye